There we go. It's not quite cool yet, but I want to go ahead and get some kind of a start. Oh. Whoa, that's pretty long. I hope I don't need anything nearly that long. I'm not scaling this thing to size. <laughs> Their knees do joint backward, so that's why I've given it this thing here. But that's really a little high for the knee. Well, it's going to have to be... Okay. The body there. It's still damp. In this part here, I <laughs> the thing is I get busy with what I'm doing and I don't talk very much. I am trying to form the structure that I'll build the body around. So I'm using a much lighter wire to try and get this, there we go, <laughs> try and get the, the legs attached here. It will work much better once I get the actual foil and other on there. It doesn't <laughs> seem to want to cooperate with me. I don't know if it's my hands being too small or what, but I'm glad for the tools. <laughs> you just gotta do what you gotta do. But I'm trying to do work it one way around and then the other way around kind of in an X pattern to stabilize it. And then I'll be able to make it more of a shape. I wish you could see, I think you can pretty much see the what I'm doing. It's a little frustrating at this point because of what it is. I, I know others who do it much more easily, and I think it's just experience, but <laughs> I, this is not a one-piece project. So that lets you know what I'm up to anyway on this part. Okay, I didn't think you wanted to watch that whole thing. Right now I'm just trying to crimp it down so that it's a little tighter. But it'll, it'll be covered with foil, and then it'll be covered with the ultralight clay. So it will stabilize when I get that part done. Right now, it just looks like a bunch of wire, <laughs> which is actually what it is, a bunch of wire. Ding dong. So <laughs> I hope you don't mind a little bit of clumsiness trying to get this crazy piece of equipment or tool out of this thing one-handed. <laughs> but I got it. I beat it. Okay. Got to be a little silly. Otherwise, I cry. No, I'm kidding. I just keep concentrating. If I had enough um, of my actual... I wouldn't be dubbing over this if I actually talked through this and explained it better because I just get to concentrate on trying to get it done, get it to work, and I just don't say, here we go, we're getting the foil. It's time to bulk it out and stabilize it a little more. <laughs>
Attaching is one thing. Now we got to get it stable and get that body bulked out. <laughs> so I know this part probably isn't so terribly entertaining, but I hope you, maybe you have fun watching somebody make a ball of, out of, <laughs> out of foil. It's not a ball, but you know what I mean. <laughs> I think a lot of this is going to be a little bit self-explanatory. Yeah, she does. They don't have tails that long. But, oh, I'm still bulking. Well, I didn't keep up with myself there. Hardy, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so, okay, I'm going to let you have a little bit of tune in here, unless I do find out that I've been speaking through this part of the video. <laughs> okay. It's flamingotainment. <laughs> I can bolt the body more, which I will. Once I get this all done and out of the way, the rest of it won't be so so hard. But I do need to remember <laughs> while I am bulking the body that I've also got to put clay on there too. Not uneven. We have a beginning of a flamingo. Sitting here, I got time. It's clear to see from up here. The world seems small. We can sit together. It's so beautiful, you and me. Meant to be in the great outdoors, forever free.
Okay. I'll worry about wings later. Just want to get a nice solid body on him. There we go. Make sure she's still. If absolutely necessary, I can trim a little wire off those legs. Once I get clay on all of it, the legs and everything, hopefully it'll hold it. In, in place better. But right now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to bake this. This is what we're trying to get to. And it's going to take a little bit. Oops. This is what we're trying to get to. The flamingo. And it's not going to be nearly so large, but we're trying to get to something that looks like that standing in its own little mug box. So I'm going to quit for, I'm going to put this in the oven tonight. It's, it's getting kind of long for me, so I'm going to put this in the oven, get it nice and baked. This is done baking. I'll have this ready to go or start tomorrow. And hopefully we can get a good get going pretty good on him. So, we'll see you tomorrow. This is the day after Christmas, so I hope everybody had a really great Christmas. I think maybe it'll be simpler the first time I collaborate with somebody if we just agree to do a, some kind of a project and then show what each other does on our own channels. I mean, I will you will maybe come up with an idea of either a coloring page or sculpture or something for me and then I will show you challenging me you can send me a little video you can email it or whatever and then I can I can give you an idea you could do a coloring page or we could draw something, just somebody let me know that they would like to do that. We can do some other form of art, something you're more in tune to. And I can try what you do. <laughs> so, I'm not a great paper folder, but I've watched a few doing some good things lately. So, if somebody wants me to challenge me at that. Anyway, or we could just collaborate on in any way we want. We can collaborate in any way we choose. Because <laughs> I really don't want to leave anybody out. We can always collaborate on a story, too. Those are always fun to collab on. So I'm going to bake this, and I will see you tomorrow. And we will hopefully get it to looking more like this here sketch. <laughs> there it is. Good night. I love you all.